Right now I want to demonstrate how to attach a strainer to your wire. This is so you can tighten up your wire. So we're going to slide the wire through the strainer. <clears throat> and all I'm going to do is come back straight and close this gap. And sometimes it's easy to have just a little bit longer thread here or a tail. But I'm just going to grab it and twist it. There again, I'm going to create my handle again. That's the key. And now I'm going to wrap it around my wire, making it nice and neat. Now, when you get short like this, it makes it a little bit harder to, um, to be able to uh, break the wire off. But there again, create a little handle. And now you can just twist it around and it comes right off. I would do this about six to eight times. I only did four right there, just because my wire was a little bit short. Um, but wrap it around six to eight times, and then crank your wire off. Now, you're going to connect the wire that's coming from the other direction. So what you want to do is take your strainer, take your wire, run it through the hole, Okay, I just ran it up through the hole and take a pair of pliers and just put a little hook on your wire. The only reason for that is when it comes back down now, it's locked in there. So now you can actually take your hand or you can take your wire, make a couple of clicks just to get the wire started on your strainer. And now you've connected your two wires. Now you can use an open end wrench here, an adjustable wrench. Um, we have a strainer handle, or you can use a socket and go ahead and tighten up your wire.